Yes, guys. Here again at KFG in St. Thomas. By the C.O. Williams flower shop at KMF Plantation. This road with the back of the dance come here via KMF, the other side of KMF. And by the poor whispering. And this is the Carl Williams flowers, C.O. Williams flowers at the KMF Plantation in St. Thomas. All can feel plantation. So again, I'm in the parish of St. Thomas, which is in the center of the island. St. Thomas and St. George are the two parishes here in Barbados, best referred to as the heart of Barbados, or the central uplands of Barbados. They don't have no sea or no crossing in these parishes. These are the two landlocked parishes in Barbados. All can feel plantation. Yes, guys. All in can feel. St. Thomas. Heading back to the Challenge School. It's going to take you back to Harrison's Cave, Welsh Mahal Gully, and by the Sturges, the floor substation at Cairnfield, and the Challenge School, as I said before, which is the school for children who are slow and who have mental challenges. We'll do it a stained school here at the Challenge School, Challenge Creative Arts and Training Centre at Cairnfield House. So this is the thing about Harrison's Cave, which is Mahogany, back to the Vault Road, by the Sturges, Carrington's Village, and that part of St. Thomas. And this is about the Cave, Fee and Dunscombe and Hillaby. And this is the tree here at Kennedy, which is in the center of Barbados. The tree here is in the center of the island at Kennedy House. This is Kennedy House, all Kennedy House in St. Thomas. So, this is before the helicopter crash over this side on the 5th of February 1992. Killing and maiming all who were on board, both the pilot Alan Heath and the four passengers who were tourists who came to Barbados and wanted to see Barbados from above. The helicopter had problems and it came crashing down just off the Vault Road, heading to King Field side. It crashed down in there at Highland Road. So, Highland Adventure Center is over here as well. And then back down to Cairnfield. 
So this is a walk through the St. Thomas countryside here in Barbados. Once again, I hope you guys enjoy this video. If you are watching, you can write underneath in the comments where, what country you are watching from. Okay, a free tenant tree here. And you can see the antenna for Flow, which was which later became which was once cable and wireless. Then it was Flow. Back up the canopy. So the antenna for Flow is here. The way to say that on a rainy on a cloudy day. You can see the island of St. Vincent. The entrance to KFV, the road of KFV, Tana Tree. And you can see the Highland Adventure Centre, which gives awesome views of the Scotland district, both St Andrew and St Joseph from here. It was once owned by Carl Williams as well, which was a horse ranch. Carl Williams, which is known to many Barbadians as Carl Williams, his, he and his brother Ralph Busy Williams have lots of businesses in Barbados, but Carl Williams passed away two years ago. So I think his son runs the business now, but his brother Ralph. Ralph Desbillion uh, is still alive and he runs lots of businesses. He has a business in St. Thomas, here in St. Thomas, but he has Williams Industries, the Williams Complex, BRC and so on. That is all his. And Carl Williams had construction company. He still has construction companies and he had the flower shop back in Canfield. All the antenna floor. This was once cable and wireless, and it was line. And this way to Hillaby, here we caught Dunscombe, Pori Spring, and Farmers at Spring Farm. The rear bottom can feel tenantry back to the rear bottom can feel Highland and Harrison's cave and Rich Mahal Gully and so on.
you can see over to the Scotland district, side of St. Joseph from here, Chimborazo and Spa Hill. So this part of St. Thomas is also in the Scotland district because it is in close part of Zimbabwe to St. Andrew. This is the Scotland district parish. Now portion of the Airy Cot Junction. Mount Misery, Airy Cot Junction. See the antenna for CBC. He's in storage St. Thomas. CBC stands for Caribbean Broadcasting Corporation, which is our state own radio and television station. CBC. We're approaching the airy cut. Junction, here we cut Mount Misery Junction. So this road leads back to Airy Cot. Other area can be referred as Airy Cot or Airy Castle in St. Thomas. I had the Airy Cot Primary School out here years ago, which closed down in the early 90s. And far as the Hillaby turned us out. The Hillaby School and then was opened in 1996 over here as the Hillaby turned us out Primary School, which is just over the other side over here. But Airy Cot Primary School was in here. We fought at Airy Cot or Airy Castle, St. Thomas. You can see Carl Williams is down, which is at Farmers in St. Thomas. For the horses, the cows, sorry, the dam here, and you can see over the Mount Hillaby, which is the highest point in Barbados, bordering St. Thomas and St. Andrew, 1116 feet, Mount Hillaby, and back at the Erie Cot, Mount Misery, Field Junction. Again, Carl Williams Dam. Here is Cam Field. You can even see the light blinking for the CBC antenna. You can see the Highland Adventure Center over here. The dam again. Over to St. Joseph with Chamber Razor. And this is the, the floor antenna, which was once Cable and Wireless slash Bartel. Cable and Wireless in Barbados, it can be referred to as Bartel, which stands for Barbados Telecommunications. Bartow and then it later became line and now it is flow the telephone antenna here yeah, in Mount Misery St. Thomas 
and as I said on a clear day, one can see St. Vincent. I don't know how true that is. Never experienced it, never saw it myself. I'm only going with what I heard. People say, you can see back over the camp and uh, Highland. Cole Williams calls once again. Which is that? Farmers, farmers in St. Thomas. Cole Williams is calls. Farmers in St. Thomas. All the rolling hills and the beautiful Scotland countryside here in Barbados. Night is drying now. As the sun said, now the day is over. Night is drying now. Shadows of the evening still across the sky. So, night is drying now. So, what I have to do is let to get out of this place. We're heading back to farmers. No, St. Thomas. I look back to this dark hole here that I just came through from. Can't really see anybody much walking on the street that kind of way. So that is so good. Over here is Ericot, the back of Ericot village, and you can see Mount Hillaby over here, which is the highest point in Barbados, 1116 feet. But all the way in St. Andrew and St. Joseph, and it is also a part of the Scotland district as well in Barbados. The Scotland district is to the east of the island, and it comprises of St. Andrew and St. Joseph, 
and they are referred as the Scotland district because of their resemblance to the Scotland countryside and there are the parishes that carry the most hills in Barbados as well <coughs> Beautiful rustic cutting here in Barbados. Mm. Got a light on over here. So this is the hilliest part of Barbados and the most scenic part as well. One of the most scenic parts in Barbados. You can even see some cows over here. These are called Williams cows as well. Cows belong to Sir Charles Anthony Williams. Known to many barbarians as cow Williams. All Corvillians Coast, got farmers in St. Thomas. Found the Cassidy Dam over here. the coats here. And back to farmer in St. Thomas once again. I made it back before the sun actually went down. Uh, at least I didn't meet much people walking, thank God. But I don't want to run to anybody that will harass me or tell me any foolishness. I did not come for that purpose, I come to take videos, not to get into anything with anybody. So I thank you much for your time. We'll see back at Farmers Mill Road, which will be back to Hillaby, Quarry Spring, Dunscombe, back to town, we name it, back from this direction. So, I have now nearly the end of my journey. Farmers housing area here.
cut the canopy rod. What's in that now? You remember about the quarry spring, Dunscombe, and Rock Hall, and back the to town? I shot her, and Lawrence, this way. And this way about the quarry spring. I mean, this way about the Hellaby Farmer Spring Farm, and by the St. Andrew. So I thank you for your time once again, guys. And have a blessed. Amen. Mm -hmm.